Okay, everyone, this particular issue is more important for the institutions. I'm going to share it with all of you just so that we can avoid some of the situations. What's been happening is a kid that's being monitored on GoGuardian Teacher opens up another window, and the only thing that shows through GoGuardian Teacher is the active window. So I talked to GoGuardian, and I do think I have a solution, so I'm going to share it with you, and you can get back to me and let me know if it works. So notice I'm at GoGuardian, I'm in the admin. I'm going to pop over to Teacher here, and what we want to make sure is that you know how to add a scene. And remember, scenes are essentially filters that we can apply to classes or take off of classes. But what we're going to do here is we're going to create a scene, and we are going to call this scene one tab. And I'll explain to you why. Student limited to one tab. The problem that we've been having is kids, like I said, are whatever on Google Docs, and then they open up another window, and then only one of the active windows is showing. And that's problematic, obviously. And GoGuardian says that windows are treated like tabs. So if we take a scene, and we limit it to a single tab, that means the kid could only be on one tab at a time. Therefore, that kid's screen would have to be viewed through GoGuardian Teacher. It may not be the best for having kids on multiple tabs working, but this would be the safest way to keep them going. So you can have this in allow mode or block mode, however you would normally have it set up. That's totally up to you. In allow mode means you're creating a blacklist. In blocked mode, that means over here you're creating a whitelist. Essentially, block mode is the most restrictive, keeps them from every site except those that you've deemed possible. But we'll, I'm going to keep this filter in allow mode, and because you could have multiple filters. This is just the one tab filter, students limited to one tab. I'm going to save that scene. And notice I've got the one tab here. So I could go to my classrooms. So just for example, 1400A here. Um, I could go in and edit this. Notice it says apply a scene to the session. I could also even go into the settings and I could apply a scene to the entire class. So I have that the, the, to the class, 1400A, and then I'm going to apply the scene of one tab and then start that session. And however you would do that, or if you have it set to auto, you'd want to go ahead and morph that. But that's how you do it. Um, let me know if you have any questions and please let me know if it works or doesn't work. I'd love to hear from you. Thank you so much.